Okay, the square root of 36. To undo these radicals, we need to turn whatever is underneath the radical into some kind of perfect square. Okay, 36 has many factors. It has 36 times 1, it has 2 times 18, it has 4 times 9, it has 12 times 3, it has 6 times 6. And that's the last one is the magic one. 6 times 6 is they're the same number. So we can rewrite 6 times 6 as 6 squared. And this is the guts of this whole chapter right here. This radical sign of 2, this the square root symbol, cancels out the exponent of 2. They are inverses of each other. Okay, so now that allows us to just basically erase the radical sign and the exponent, and that leaves us with 6. But very important, anything that you take the square root of has two values. It will have a positive value and a negative value. So just remember, I like negative 6 times negative 6. They're, they're the same number, and when you multiply them, you're going to get a positive 36. So there's always two values for the square root of anything, but in this chapter, we're just going to stick to what we call the principal square root, and that's just the positive square root. So I hope that helped. And you see, out.